Hey family, this is your girl, Mom P. Welcome to Mom P. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button. Um, please like, share, and comment. Today we are talking about these three wonderful actresses, what they have to offer in the industry and what they've already achieved in the industry. Listen and learn and get to know them better and what I have to say at the end. Stay tuned. No, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, Lady Afonsin was born to a, on the 24th October 1984. She's an actress, writer, and producer. Lydia was born in Mankasin, Ghana. She received her early education at Wilmore Elementary School in Kent, Turkey. So, at the age of nine, her family moved to Ghana, where she continued her education at Akosombo International School. She also attended St. Louis Secondary School in Kumasi, where she completed her secondary school education. Fawson graduated from the University of Ghana, earning her bachelor, bachelor's degree in English Language and International Studies. Her acting career started with a cameo role in Hotel St. James, 2005 to be precise, Run Baby Run, 2006. Different Shades of Blue, which is 2007, and was part of the reality show Next Movie Star in Niger, the infamous movie star, which everybody loved. Stop. CEO of Spiral Production, who had previously worked with her in the Ghanaian television series Different Shades of Blue, brought her back to the screen through the movie Scond. This starring role led her first African Movie Academy Awards nomination as the best upcoming female actress. So her hit began from there. Now she has received so many awards and is making on her own production, like her own products. She's even a TikTok queen. Her mom is her life and she can't do away with her as they started a business together. Now she's a judge on Ghana Most Beautiful. Ayo, Yvonne Nelson was born November 12, 1985. She's a Ghanaian actress, model, film producer, and entrepreneur. Yvonne Nelson was born in Accra, Ghana. She is a descendant of the Fanti people in Ghana. She studied education at St. Martin de Peru School in Accra. And later went to Agri Memorial Secondary Senior High School. She had her tertiary education at Senate University College and Central University, where she did her degree course in human resource management. She is a former Miss Ghana contestant, best bust bust to the movie in scene with big screen roles in Princess Tyra and Playboy. She dived into movie production in 2011. Her first production was the movie The Price. She was released. She was released. It was released that year. Sorry. She also produced Single and Married in 2012 and House of Gold in 2013. On October 29th, 2017, Nelson gave birth to her daughter, Wayne Roberts, with her ex-boyfriend, Jimmy Roberts. In recent times, Nelson has taken it upon herself, together with celebrities, to add more voices to the masses in protest against the energy crisis in her country. She led a peaceful vigil called Doom so a Stop on May 16, 2015. She told BBC in an interview that she may consider running for political office in future. So, Jackie Apia, born December 8, 1983, is a Canadian-born Ghanaian actress. 
for her work as an actress. She has received several awards and nominations, including awards for Best Actress in Leading Role at 2010 um, Africa Movie Academy Awards and Best Actress in Supporting Role at African Movie Academy Awards in 2007. She received two nominations for Best Actress in Leading Role and Best Upcoming Actress at African Movie Academy Awards in 2008. Jackie is the last of five kids born in Toronto. Sty spent her early childhood in Canada, moved to Ghana with her mom at age 10. Jackie married Peter Ajuman in 2005 and had one son. Appear's father is Kobna Apia, the younger brother of the late Joe Apia, a famous lawyer in Kumasi, currently residing in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Jackie was invited by Edward Sado Jr., the writer of Things We Do For Love, where she played the role in your name, Bragogi. She later took part in Tentacles, Games People Play, Sun City, and many other TV series. Jackie was shy before she remembered when she went on set. It was um, Venom's film production titled Divine Love and How to Play a Role, Kate. The protagonist. Jackie it says her best part was Mommy's Daughter by Venus Film. She played the role of a princess. Apia now sees the local film industry as having changed for the better. Jackie is already known to Nollywood through her movies, successful Ghanaian films, including Beyonce, The President's Daughter, Princess Tyra, etc. Her notable Nollywood films include Black Soul and Better Blessing. She won the Best International Actress Award at the Pyros Magazine Screen Actress Award 2013, which was held in Abuja. Her face has been on so many billboards and TV commercials in Ghana, including a JSMF advert on protection against HIV and AIDS. One face of UB in promotion she did for them on TV commercials, and she's currently face of IPNC. Hey guys, meet Funky Akidele. She's um, now the producer of Jennifer Derry and she's a Nigerian actress. She's doing so well in the industry and she's employing newcomers to be styled in her um, series and people are actually being recognized. I like the way this lady is all into her uh, comedy series and it's actually doing well for people. And then meet uh, Mary Remy Joku. I'm sorry if I didn't get the name right. And um, um, she has this channel called Aroko TV where she shows both Ghanaian movies and Nigerian movies as well. She's actually doing well for her country and everything. So let's come to the main reason why I am here. I see that we have opportunity in Ghana. We have actresses and actors who have made it big in the industry. They say Ghana did not help them with the actress, um, the industry. They didn't get much from it, but they got all their sources from the world or whatever. But even if you got it and you want Ghanaian other kids to grow up to be successful, you got an opportunity from here for other people to see you. That's why you went as far as being where you are so if you open a door like you create something out of your, you create your own series or something and bring new comments even though say you are doing great but can you please bring fresh new faces for them to also be part of what you are doing so that they too can hit to that level you guys are for our future generation to be successful they say gallywood is collapsing it has already collapsed we need you guys to come together to build it don't wait for the government to come and put uh, money in in the industry 
people build it themselves so please kindly do something about it you are my favorite actresses and it will be disappointing to see that um Gali will fail because some actresses are not doing their best so please if you like my video kindly hit the subscribe button like and share and wait, uh, hit the notification bell so that you receive any video i post later bye no yeah, yeah. Dynasty, yeah.